Well, a Florida man takes matters into his own hands when a large reptile shows up in his neighborhood. Let's just say he learned his lesson the hard way. <laughs> Unfortunately, if you play stupid games, you win stupid prizes. Mm. And Ooh. after the alligator crawled towards some homes in Charlotte City, neighbors Ooh. say the gator got angry, as you can imagine, grabbed the man mm. by the arm. Ah. Witnesses, they watched in horror, not really sure how to react or what to do. Yikes. Now, eventually the gator oh, did no. let go and was relocated by FWC. Yeah, mm. call the experts. Don't try to do it That's yourself. That's the one thing, yeah. you know, you don't, I know folks want to take mm -hmm. matters into their own hands, nope. but there are certain things that you just got to get someone who's yeah. a professional, you know, that, um, yeah, that's painting. not a do it. That's not how you do it yourself. <laughs> no, no, it's not. Roof Ouch. repair, you know, that kind of <laughs> stuff. Reptile removal. Yeah, reptile removal falls into that category. And where do, who do you call? There's got to be a number. We should all have that number posted on the refrigerator. You should. I mean, we live right? in the state. You gotta, you gotta <laughs> you know have it. Don't to worry who about to call me. Because... If there's a gator. I think 911 will work. Yeah, okay, all right. Yeah, I know. I wouldn't be anywhere near. I that mean, thing. just a lizard gets in, and that's right? enough oh, of a problem. That happened to me once, Bridget. A lizard was on my couch. <laughs> right. and I oh, how nice. It's like, what are we watching today? I got a flip flop, and I picked it up, and I took it outside. It was safe. This arrest. Hardware couch. Now you better get your paws <laughs> off of it. <laughs>